I'm back here and uh, we have a new um a new uh neck mount for the pocket three that we uh were sent uh from the good folks over to start rc to do a little uh you know unboxing first look and uh review well you know review when we get out in the field but this is mostly going to be the unbox first review set up here and uh you know um this is um you know quite a um you know interesting product here or whatever you know these neck mounts uh, help you keep your you know your hands free so you can do other stuff when you're trying to do things between recording with a pocket three so let's first get into the unboxing of this see what comes in the package here and then we'll um you know get the pocket three out and and do a kind of a stall guide here for you so with no further ado let's get in straight into the unboxing okay so you can see the starter typical starter rc branding with their you know logo in the red and white and top left hand corner here then you get a, a diagram or a picture of the pocket three and how the strap uh fits around there and then you get the description of you know, what it is that mount for pocket three and the chinese characters saying the same thing uh you know on the side of the box you got the start uh, rc logo there on the back you have a uh, you know just some more pictures here um you know uh, this is a sticker here from the the company that it sold it's made in china that's a important to you and uh that's about it on the box of the star rc logo there nothing on the bottom so i pre-cut the little tape off here so we can you know won't waste any time the only cutting on the video here so okay got that top open here and uh we'll dump all the things out of the box here okay there's that's it in the box so we'll get that to the side for right now here and uh, we're gonna open up now we got a, a bag in the box here which is typical here too this is the you know the same kind of easy open bag here that star rc sends for you know most of their products here so let's see let's get everything out here and then we'll kind of go over them one by one here so okay so that looks like everything out of the bag so we'll we'll put that bag back in the box again here kind of tidy up everything here a little bit for the uh you know for the video here so okay let's see what we got here you know i didn't see any you know i didn't look hard enough was there instructions in there here i don't uh I'm seeing any instructions. Yeah, usually they send like a little instruction guide, but I don't see anything here. Uh, if you if you go to Amazon.com, which this is sold there, I'm gonna you know put a link of to where you can go over there and purchase this from um, Amazon. I am an, a, an affiliate seller, so I do get a small commission off anything you purchase through the link I'm gonna put in the video, and it does help the channel, helps me get more things into review here. So what's what's got meanwhile back at the ranch here? Let's get back to the. Um, the subject in, at hand here okay so here obviously is a strap here and uh you know it looks like it has um you know some kind of a clipping mechanism system here on on either end one's different than the other it looks like um we have two you know typical kind of gopro type uh screws there here and uh here's a uh, some kind of like a of a plate here and i i see those things that showed you earlier this is going to snap into this plastic here and uh let's see here what's in this bag here all right we have a kind of a quarter screw screw them out there with a kind of a gopro style fingers up top and then for the final piece of the puzzle here we have uh what looks to be your your kind of gopro you know i mean your gopro got your gopro things there but it looks like this is you know where the uh pocket three actually you know goes down into so start our c branding there so we're gonna put this all together now and uh, see if um you know we can get this demo here get it together and demo you know, how to use it so uh folks we will you'll be right back here uh don't go anywhere okay folks luckily i found a, a, a pocket three close by so we can get kind of start on this you know on this project here all right folks we have it assembled here and uh you can see that uh, this front piece leaves the uh joystick and the record button you know completely exposed here for you to use has this piece up here and down below and here it is from the side um here's that that thumb screw going in there you 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 put this piece on the um pocket three and then you have the gopro figures there and they go into this mount i have it in the position that you would have it hanging on the neck here i'm going to show you in a second how how that works too here's where the uh the strap goes in down here you just kind of click it in like like this let me show you as best i can here 
you know, easy click in and uh, it's a, a button right there. I try to show you with the, the light here. There you go. See that button there? Push that button. Probably got out of focus there. Push this button and it comes out. You know, but it's 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 once in there, it's secure, you know. You have to hit that release button to get it off of there. So and then you know you put that on, put it around your neck. It, it it's you know, it's the, the thing is small enough, which is good, that you know you can't put it over your head. You have to, you know, get it around your neck and do it then. I'm gonna show you in just a second here in the video here. Now I was trying to figure out some of the extra parts over here. Um uh, I don't I haven't figured out what these little um you know look like little spaces are for yet, but uh I'll I'll reach out to my contacts at the start RC. But luckily they do give you a little mount here that also allows you to uh use a, an action camera with this instead of the pocket three. So this one device will uh this one mount here oh you do more than one camera. So all the camera just needs to have a quarter inch screw in the bottom. And I'm gonna show you in a second you get just an extra one of these thumb wheels here too. You know, I guess just to go with that one. You know, uh I guess you you could just you keep using the one, but uh nice they gave you that backup one, right? You know, in case you lose something here. So um let me uh quickly show you how to um you know put the GoPro on here instead of the um pocket three and then we'll be back uh you know, I'll show them, you know, with with them on uh you know around the neck and all that and how easy they are to, you know, get on and off, you know, when you're in the field trying to um you know, uh, get ready to take video very quickly in the field. Here is the GoPro Hero 12. I said, any camera that has the um, the little uh, quarter inch screw in the bottom and the Go this GoPro here, the previous GoPros only had the GoPro, um, you know, kind of arms there, uh, you know, and you had to uh, get some kind of a adapter, but this one has the quarter inch built in. So we'll take the quarter inch screw like this get it in there securely here all right so then we'll uh, mount it to this um you know this bracket right here again and put one of our quarter inch screws on the side here well voila you know it's, it's all assembled here um you know ready to um put on the next strap and and you know quickly uh take it on and off for a shooting so uh, let's show um Show it with the neck strap on. Okay, I have the, uh, you know, the neck strap on here, very, very secure. Um, it's got kind of a wiry material in here, so this is bendable, you know, bendable and it uh, holds shape. So, uh, you really want to, you know, if you want to walk along a film like that, uh, you can aim the camera up like this, which of course you would. So it gives you kind of that chest mount look. Remember you used to have those chest straps, the things would strap all around you and, you know, almost like, uh, constrain you they were so tight here so this is a lot easier just having this little you know a neck mount thing rather than that big old chest strap here and this chest strap if you want to take if you want to go from chest strap shot to um you handheld shot man that was a lot of work getting that thing off but this thing here say i want i was taking some chest strap type video here and i wanted to get it off i would just you know hit with the release valve the release button down here release button down here just take it right off and i could go right into filming the other one this is, looks dumb you know um uh, handcuffs but get the other one right off here and i could just walk around and film you know like as a regular um you know camera here and you know these little extra uh holes and that thing maybe there so you can mount onto something else too you know probably a lot of possibilities of this but um uh, that's how quickly you can get it off and be shooting in, in kind of a normal um uh, you know, shooting mode if you did not want to have it on your chest. So, okay, let's try the GoPro now. I mean, we did try the GoPro. I got the uh, the pocket three and the neck strap here. Uh, you know, it's kind of, you know, almost chin high here, but the, it, it's just at the right height that I'm like a six foot tall, you know, uh, uh, 215 pound man here. So, uh, you can put this on, you know, but the strap, so if you have your strap on your pocket three, you know, I have to remove the strap. So, let's just turn this puppy on here. You just turn on just by opening that window here. See the gimbal come to life here. So okay, the gimbal is facing me because I had it in selfie mode last time. But you just take this. Oops. You just take that little uh, thing here and hit it three times. The little scroll wheel here. Of course, I can't get one, two, three. There the camera comes around you. So I'm going to do like Marcus Carver does. I'm going to move in. See that gimbal in action here. You know, look. <laughs> so, um. Yeah.
So it seems to work well. Um, again, I started this off this kind of video by saying it's for the Pocket 3, but we also see that it works on an action camera such as the Hero 12 that has a quarter inch uh, screw mount on on the bottom of it here. You know, I don't, I don't, I don't know if the Action 4 has a quarter inch screw mount or not, and I do not have the. Um, uh, it's the 360 East Pro, so I cannot comment on that, uh, but uh, I will check to see if the Action 4 also has a screw mount availability on the bottom. So, okay, um, I think that's all we need to talk about here. I, again, I will figure out what these spaces are for here. I've got two of them. Uh, I'll reach out to my contact at uh, Star RC and, you know, see what they're all about here. I, I can't figure it out. And, and uh, there was no there was no video on how to do the install. So, but I do want to say that uh, I am leaving the you know the uh, uh, Start RC uh, affiliate link down below for the uh, the next trap thing. Um, it, it's it uh, retails for nineteen ninety nine. And let me get the more information here for you folks you know, who may want to order here. Um, it uh, nineteen ninety nine, and it even shows in a video. Uh, it works. Well, it shows in a video. It works with the Action Four or the actually the video, the um, promotional material on Amazon. The Action Four shows the Insta three sixty, um, probably um, X three here. Yeah, no, it actually shows in the X two, but um, probably works in the X three as well. So um, let me uh, get this down here okay so I, I did mention it sells for $19.99 on amazon.com I will leave a link down below they offer two-day free shipping for prime members here so if, like for instance this is Saturday the uh, March um, March something or another here uh, March 2nd uh, I would if I ordered it right now at uh, about 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time it would be here by Monday so um, you know that that's that's great. It said nineteen ninety nine. If you think something like this is going to be helpful, you know, out in the field for you, uh, in your videos, there you go. Can't beat nineteen ninety nine. I don't have any um, so many coupons or codes for at this point, but uh, there may be at some point. So um, if you got anything on this video, give me the old thumbs up here at Ron Brown's YouTube channel. Uh, ring uh, ring the bell, you know, notification, so you'll know when I put new videos up on, you know, Pocket 3 related stuff and just start RC um, gear in general. I also do drones and action cameras and so on. And I forgot to say, you know, subscribe to the channel if you're already a member. It helps me, it helps, you know, me get uh, you higher rankings on, uh, you know, YouTube's um, SEO, you know, their algorithm thing, whatever. So please, you know, just take a second to subscribe. It didn't cost you anything. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got something out of it. Any questions or comments, leave them down below and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. And we will see you on the next video, folks.